Hello everyone and welcome to episode 83 of this Let's Play series of Star Trek Online. My name is Winters and we are about to move on to the mission Cold Storage. So let's hail Starfleet and um, get our mission brief. Okay, so this will actually give us um, the third and final part of the Breen set. And we also have a choice of this item here which is um, a cryo gun. Um, you can see the stats there. Uh, it's a unique item. Um, so uh, I'll most likely be going with the shield just to complete the set for the sake of having it in case you know I ever want it again. Um, this weapon isn't you know game changing. So um, yeah, my recommendation is go with the shield. So let's accept the mission. We'll close out of this and we will begin cold storage. Okay, it looks like there's a battle going on here at the minute. Um, who's closer? These guys are closer. Some of these guys are closer. We'll, we'll go over here to this group. Defeat hostile squadrons. You got it. Uh, I'm going to aim my gravity well on this guy. Boom. And let's hope that uh, some of them... Oh yeah, look at that. This is why I love gravity wells and uh, can of scatter volley. <laughs> oh man, that was epic. I love it. Did one? Where the hell did he come from? Let's take him out real quick. Okay, that's him taken care of. Evasive maneuvers, get back over here to these guys and open up. Kick into reverse. Um, this is something that I actually uh, haven't mentioned. Uh, for my fourth weapon on the aft, I threw in the clo cloaking tractor mines that we got from the mission. Oh, it was in the Romulan story arc. Um, oh man, what was the name of the mission? Uh, Romulan, uh, not the vault. Uh, hidden house. Uh, was it cutting the cord? Cutting the cord. Um, yeah, because I didn't have a, a an extra weapon, so I said, "Screw it, I'll throw uh, them in instead." And um, yeah, they're nice. Um, if uh, Any uh, enemy ships that get uh, tracked by them, uh, you know, they'll be stopped and uh, basically like that, uh, you know, it makes them a hell of a lot easier to kill because they're not moving, which means they don't have any bonus defense. So it's a nice little trick. Um, yeah, so that's why I decided to throw them on. Anyway, let's beam down to the planet and we'll get the next stage of this mission complete. Okay, so now we have some ground combat -y stuff. Well, you can see on the mini-map we've got some bringing up ahead uh, just to our right. So once we get up to the top here, that's what we're going to do. We're going to turn around to our right. And there they are up ahead. Where's my bridge officers? Ah, there they are. Excellent. Some loot. While my bridge officers are taking care of the last guy, I will scan this. Enemy 
Ooh, cryo grenade just caught me. Proceed onward. We'll get up out of this uh, cryo grenades um, damage area. Okay, so we're going to slip down to the left here. And there's another group of Breen for us to take out. Oh, cry grenade. Crap, crap. They can really hurt if uh, you don't spot them in time. Alright, we have some anomalous readings to scan. Our bridge officers can finish off whoever's left. Grab this bit of loot. And now we're going up here. I actually, um, I don't mind the brain story arc. I think that it's uh, pretty well laid out. I mean, you know, we had... We had some missions there where, you know, we were doing science-y stuff. You know, we were flying from A to B to C to D, and so on. And, you know, there was no combat. Um, there was, uh, uh, what was it, cold comfort on the ship where, you know, we were scanning and healing and helping civilians. And then we had to do an interrogation. Again, no combat. Um, and uh, this one then, uh, you know... It's a little bit heavy on, not too heavy though, on uh, the ground combat side. You know, so I think there's a nice mixture in the brain story arc. Uh, I actually don't mind it. Um, you have a little bit of everything in it. Come on. There we go. We don't have any more loot there. Okay, so moving on. Uh, I'm going to walk up. I want to give a few seconds for my abilities to come off cooldown. Because there is going to be another battle here. Yeah, close enough. Ooh, alright, let's uh, use a hypo spray. Wow, two of my bridge officers are down. Crud. Alright, you revive them, and I'll revive this one. You useless muppet. And now you do it. For God's sake. Um, another hypo spray. Okay, and now we can enter the archive. So we just go up these steps and we interact with it. Okay. Um, so we just uh, keep on moving forward. Hmm. That's... Oh, it's to the side. Yeah, there. Yeah, there we are. 
Silly me. See what I mean? It's been quite a while since I played these missions. Okay, some bad guys here. Uh oh. Server not responding. Sorry about that, everyone. Uh, I got a DC there, and um, it took me quite a while to get reconnected. Um, the problem was on my end. It wasn't uh, any fault of the game. Um, but yeah, um, this is where it's thrown me back out, so uh, apologies for that. Um, we wouldn't have lost any major progress. I think we had just gone in here and started fighting the first group of guys in this doorway, so uh, yeah, there's nothing major lost. Okay, so that's them taken care of. We continue moving on forward. Whoa, cryo grenade coming in. Yeah, let's uh, pick up our loose. Oh, it looks like uh, one of our bridge officers is down. Uh, I'll let uh, the other bridge officers revive her. Ooh. Oh. Ah, crud. Alright, we'll call for help. Who is going to come to my aid? Calais, thank you. And we'll go in range of this medical generator to help uh, regenerate our health. And there's one group up here. I'll take care of these guys now. Man, those cryo grenades really mess you up. Or they can really mess you up. Okay, um... Now, this part... Let's see, was this... I think it was this one down here. Uh, there's three consoles. One here, one there, and one back there. And when you interact with each one, there will be a different tone. And you have to get the order low, mid, and high. So this one, if you listen, there's the low tone. And I believe this is the next one, if I remember correctly, which will be the mid tone. And it will sound slightly higher than the first one. Yeah, see? Mid tone. And then this is the high tone. And then we have uh, some bream to kick their arses. Wah, ah, 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 ah. Should be one more group that beams in, and there they are. Get flanking damage on them. Defend access console. We've done that. Oh, this is the third group. Excellent. Okay, so we just pick up our loot and then we will proceed onwards. 
So we're going this way. Which is north, and then we're going west. Remember these guys? Have a closer look. Remember them? It's not um, uh, the founders. There's a better look at them, actually. Uh, do you remember that episode of uh, TNG? Uh, I think it was called The Chase, uh, when um, Jean-Luc Picard's archaeology professor came aboard the Enterprise, and he had discovered some tremendous truth or piece of information that was groundbreaking. Um, these are the same guys. I think that episode was called The Chase. It was a good episode, actually. Uh, I actually really enjoyed it. Okay, I'm going to go over here and get ready for the battle that is about to ensue. Lunge will take care of that guy. Boss got yet, yeah, there he is. He turns up. Now this could really mess up my day. Thankfully it was just one of my bridge officers. Take that medical generator. And we continue around this way, picking up our loot and taking on the next bunch of guys. Uh, in case you're wondering, I'm saving my abilities because the boss guy is going to come back and uh, he can take a little bit of a beating. Um, so I'm just uh, saving them for him and letting any of them that were, you know, is on cooldown come off cooldown. So he should turn up here now any second. There he is. We'll call in some security guys. Kick his ass. Time to die. Time for you to die. Oh, he's called in his own reinforcements. Yeah. Okay, and now we talk to the Defera science team, which should be beaming in any second. Now. There they are. No, no, actually, wait a minute. Uh, this is the one, I think. Yep, depart system. bit of a sudden end to that mission, um, but uh, I enjoyed it. Uh, I hope you guys did. Um, so yeah, let's hail Starfleet. We will get our final piece of the Breen set, 
And that concludes uh, the Breen story arc, and we are now on to the Borg story arc. Um, this is going to lead us back into the Beta Quadrant. Now, I should also point out, uh, here under the Available tab, um, we do have a number of missions, uh, these ones here, uh, from Ambassador Sora. Uh, these are daily missions um, that have been unlocked now since we have completed the Breen story arc. And um, they're not bad for Dilithium. Uh, 1440 Dilithium there for this particular mission. Um, and uh, you can see Emancipation, Rescue Deferi Captives and Aiding the Deferi. All of these take place in the Alpha Quadrant and it's usually around this area here. Um, and it's, yeah, you know, they, they can make nice dailies. If um, if you don't like mining for the lithium, maybe you won't mind doing, you know, these three missions once a day, every day, uh, every 20 hours. So, um, yeah, there's a little tip for you guys for maybe uh, reaching your daily 8,000 or 8,500 the lithium for your, yeah, farming. Anyway, uh, yeah, we'll leave it there for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please do like, comment, and subscribe. That will help me out enormously. Um, and I really appreciate you guys' support. So, uh, until next time, my name is Winters, and take care.